Asian markets rebounded slightly today after Monday's losses. Tokyo's Nikkei was up half a percentage point, while Hong Kong's Hang Seng edged up a fraction. Today, Wall Street gets another check of the housing market. On Monday, stocks took a fall after the EU failed to fully finance its bailout fund. The Dow lost 100 points, while the Nasdaq was down 32. Federal regulators are delaying new oversight rules for the $600 trillion derivatives market. Those are the complex investments largely blamed for triggering the financial crisis. The rules were mandated more than two years ago, but regulators say they need time because it's also complicated. If you're missing four grand or so, it probably went into your gas tank. The average American spent $4,155 on gas this year. That is a record. It's been 30 years since gasoline took such a big bite out of the family budget. And it's not expected to get much better next year with prices forecast to stay high. And everybody hates ATM fees. Soon you'll be able to avoid them even when you're not at your bank. But there is a catch. Free ATM NYC plans to launch thousands of fee-free cash machines across the country. Instead of paying a charge, you'll have to watch a commercial. That's your Money Watch. For more, stay with CBSMoneyWatch.com. In New York, I'm Ashley Morrison.